We should get some ice for your hand. Let me look at it. Fitz. How long? What? How long have you been screwing Andrew? How long have I... Are you serious? Does it matter? It matters. So you can cheat and I can't, is that it? Well, I didn't want to have a double standard. It matters. Seriously, Fitz, let's not pretend that you are the victim You turned here. me away. What? After Jerry was born, you turned me away. You stopped wanting me. Fitz. You wouldn't let me touch you. And when I asked you about it, what did you say? We don't need to go into that. What did you say, Melly? What did you say? That having a baby changed me, that I wasn't a sexual person anymore. That having a baby anymore. changed you, that you weren't a sexual person anymore. You made it clear that that part of our marriage was dead, that you were dead inside. I said that because there were reasons. You turned me away. Were you screwing Andrew when you told me that? It's not. But you're screwing me now. Are you screwing him now? Are you? Yes. So you're not dead inside. So you are a sexual person. Because you're not turning Andrew away. I don't see what that has to you do with it. You don't get it. You really don't get it? If you are saying that I am to blame for your affair with Olivia... I am Paris, saying you ruined our marriage. What? You! You ruined our marriage. You shut me down. You locked the door. You killed us. I would never have cheated. I would never have gone looking elsewhere. But I'd spent 10 years with a wife who wouldn't let me touch her. 10 years. And I never blamed you. It wasn't your fault you didn't want me. Poor Melly, my poor wife's dried up. She can't control her body or her libido. But it turns out, that was a lie. It wasn't that you didn't want sex, it was that you didn't want me, because you're all hot and bothered for Andrew, and I have spent all this time feeling guilty, feeling like a monster, feeling like I broke us. And it was you, you did this, you ruined our marriage, you killed us. You killed us, Melly. Don't you see that? Don't you see what you did? We never had a chance. Those kids never had a chance at growing up with two loving, happy parents. Don't you dare put this on me. I have given my life for you. If you knew what I have done what to get you, you where done, you are. Emily? All you've done is deny me love and scheme to have power. You tell me one thing that you have done, one thing that you have sacrificed, one thing that you have lost because of me, because I lost my marriage. I lost my wife. What have you lost? What have you lost? I'm sorry to interrupt, but we need to focus on the problem. What have you lost, Melly? We have to sit down with the reporter and less than... What have you lost? Fitz! I'm talking to my wife! Liv, I'm sorry. 